السلام عليكم ديال فاميليون كوليت ام تريكون هير وي ريتشيد ويك 2 ان ديب ميديسين توداي وي ويل ديسكاس ديب ميديسين ان ليرنينغ اند اسسمنت باي جروب 7 اي وود لايك تو ويلكم اول اوف يو اند هوبفلي وي ويل هاف ا فروتفول ويك اي ام هايدي سمير بروفيسور اوف ميديكال مايكروبيولوجي اند ايمولوجي هلوين يونيفرسيتي Today, our learning objectives are to recognize the common applications of artificial intelligence in learning, recognize the common applications of artificial intelligence in assessment. Let me remind you with this figure, which have this been discussed during the first week, we have the umbrella of artificial intelligence that include inside it the machine learning and the deep learning. Let me remind you also with this figure, which include the eight rules of the medical educator. It has been discussed during the first week. The eight rules of medical educators are professional, information provider and coach, facilitator and the monitor, curriculum developer and the implementer, assessor, role model as a teacher and practitioner, manager and leader, scholar and researcher. We will discuss the artificial intelligence tools that can improve the following rules in the medical education. The medical educators in the learning, the role of medical educator in the assessment. During week one, we already discussed the artificial intelligence tools that improve the role of the medical educator as a researcher. Artificial intelligence powered student learning. Why artificial intelligence in higher education? Artificial intelligence in higher education become a mandate in the all fields that we, we have to meet a new generation of digital native knocking at their door. Online learning with different time zones have been widely spread all over the earth and now there is application which can provide around the clock support for the students. This is useful in the online learning with the students spread across so many time zones. They can adjust their assignment dates, their meetings, and so on with different time zones. What is the impact of artificial intelligence in higher education? The learning process become more effective, more efficient, and more deep. We have to take care that we must have an interesting student in the learning process as no app to persuade a reluctant student to enroll yet. What we need from the artificial intelligence in the learning process. We need to personalize the learning plan. We need to improve the student engagement. We need to enhance the learning process and we need to organize the data. What should we consider during the using of artificial intelligence in learning? We need to consider the data privacy, bias, and transparency. We will take a look around some artificial intelligence tools that are used in learning, and some of them also can be used in the assessment process. In this part, I will give a summary of each of the artificial intelligence tools used in learning. Number one, Great Scope. In this tool enables students to assess each other while providing feedback. Great Scope relies on a combination of machine learning and artificial intelligence to make it easier to grade, which saves time and energy. Great Scope can be used by the teacher to grade paper-based exams and online homework as well as to prepare projects all in one place. You can use this link for Gradescope tool. Number two, Dragon Speech Recognition for Education. This tool makes words work for you. Dragon transcribes your words into text and reads them back to you so you can edit until you are satisfied. Use Dragon to read aloud anything from homework instructions to incoming emails. You can use this link for Dragon tool. Number three, Cognai. Uh, this tool engages a student in a chatbot style learning conversation by prompting them to construct an answer, giving them instant formative assessment, tutoring them with a personalized hints and tips, and guiding them toward conceptual knowledge. 
an example Kogna asked the student what are the structure of a typical neuron student answer neurons are the basic building blocks of the nervous system Kogna very close would you like to explain the neural transmitter no G it's an application for language learner it is an audiovisual vocabulary application for all learning styles you can use www.nodg.com for use this tool. Number six, Plato. This tool acts as a coach, giving prompts to move students forward as they write, debate, and collaborate in existing new ways. Speaks for languages, provide game learning and challenges. You can sign up in this uh, website to Plato. Number seven, Querium. This tool helps students master critical STEM skills, STEM skills which are science, technology, engineering, mathematics. It analyzes answers and the length of time it took to complete tutoring lessons, which helps instructors gain insight into students' learning habits and areas of improvement. You can use this link for Querium. Century Tech this tool tracks student progress while pointing out knowledge gaps. It provides personal study recommendations and feedback, helps teachers in planning and grading. You can use this link for Century Tech tool. IV Chatbot. This tool can provide much needed information to students, such as important details. It can be applied across departments, thanks to its ability to develop specialized chatbots for each one. On it's used on bonds, scholarships, grants, tuition payment, and others. Live chat and SMS nudging, integrations for Facebook. It becomes smarter over time through interaction with users. For software application, you can follow this link. In this part, we will talk about the role of artificial intelligence in student assessment. Artificial intelligence-powered student assessment tools are becoming increasingly popular in education, offering benefits such as improved efficiency and accuracy in grading, personalized learning experience, and data-driving insights into student performance. However, concerns have been raised about the potential for bias and the impact on teacher-student interactions and educational outcomes. Artificial intelligence-based student assessment has the potential to revolutionize teaching practices by providing teachers with real-time data on student performance and identifying areas where students may need additional support. This can enable teachers to personalize instruction and provide targeted interventions to help students succeed. So, what are the rules of AI in assessment? Number one, assessment at scale. Second, automated item generation, AI in peer-to-peer -peer assessment, and che checking for cheating. Assessment at scale. AI has been used to support student learning and assessment for many years. AI systems can do this for a variety of forms of assessment. For example, mathematical problem solving, short and long essays, multiple choice questions. There are many such systems, such as Project Essay Grade and Essay Marketing Software. Automated item generation. One challenge for instructors is to design an assessment instrument, where it be a formative assessment intended to aid learning or a summative assessment intended to provide a grade for learning. AI can generate items used in tests, examinations, and assessments. The instructor creates a, an item model showing the system what an ideal test or set of tests looks like. The system then generates samples, which can be refined. For example, if an assessment typically has 10 items, 4 on key knowledge, 3 testing the knowledge in use, and 3 on alternative approaches to problem solving. The AI system replicates this approach in each sample test it creates. Once the AI samples are confirmed or modified by the instructor, the AI system generates thousands of versions of the test. One aspect of assessment practices that has grown significantly in the past decade is the use of software to support peer-to-peer -peer assessment. Services like Critic and Peer Septive 
all make use of smart technologies and AI to facilitate fair and appropriate peer assessment. Checking for cheating. As AI reviews a student's work, it can also automatically check for plagiarism and other forms of cheating. For example, two or more students in the same cohort through providing identical answers. AI systems can also compare handwriting samples from a student's past work with their examination submission to verify that the student who took the exam is the same person who submitted assignments during the course. AI proctoring systems such as Exam Online and Proctor Edu can be used. What is the impact of AI powered student assessment on educational outcome? Research on impact of these tools on educational outcome is still in its early stages. However, some students have shown positive results in terms of improved student engagement, increased efficiency in grading, and personalized learning experiences. It is also important to continue monitoring the impact of these tools on educational outcomes and addressing any potential issues related to bias and teacher-student interaction. So, what are the benefits of AI in student assessment? Number one, efficiency. AI can quickly grade assessments and provide feedback to students, saving time for teachers and allowing for more frequent assessments. Personalization. AI can analyze student data and provide personalized recommendations for learning, helping students improve their skills and knowledge. Objectivity. AI can eliminate bias in grading and provide objective feedback to students, ensuring fairness in the assessment. So what are the challenges of AI in student assessment? Data privacy, for example, AI requires access to student data, which raises concerns about privacy and security. Reliability, AI may not always be accurate in grading and providing feedback leading to incorrect assessments and potentially harming student performance. Lack of human interaction. AI cannot replace value of human interaction in the assessment process, such as teacher-student uh, feedback and discussion. Here is some tools that can be used in AI for assessment. For example, Igmentum, Cogni, and Dreambox Learning. Edmentum offers a suite of AI-powered assessment tools that provide personalized learning paths for students based on their individual needs and abilities. These tools also offer real-time feedback for teachers to monitor student progress and adjust teaching strategies as needed. Cogni offers an AI-powered virtual assistant that can provide instant feedback and guidance to students as they complete assignments. This tool also provides detailed analytics to teachers to help them identifying areas where students may be struggling and adjust their teaching methods accordingly. Dreambox it also offers an AI-powered adaptive learning platform that adjusts to each student's skill level and learning style. This tool also provides detailed analytics to teachers to help them understand the student progress and identify areas where additional support may be needed. Here you can use this platform to find tools of AI that can help you as a medical educator. Lastly, the second week assignment. You are requested to reflect your attitudes and self-perceived anxiety related to using AI technology in medical education and health profession. Once you submitted the form, you will receive a feedback regarding your perception and anxiety level score from Deep Medicine ML Web team members. For further clarification, we will be glad to hear from you. For further information and knowledge, you can navigate through these references. Thank you for being with us for two weeks.